Hi, my name is Jee Ramachandran, PGP 2013-15 from IIM Ahmedabad. I am Srijit. I graduated from IIM Lucknow in uh, 2015. Currently, I am working with Deloitte's TSNA service line. Uh, hello, my name is Manu. I study in FMS Delhi. Uh, currently in my final semester. And uh, I am about to join the corporate world very soon. I'll join a company called Deloitte where I'll be doing strategy and operations consulting. Uh, one mistake that I would say that it is focusing more on CAT and less on GD or VAC or PA. And uh, before that it used to be GD and PA. I thought I was very confident because I used to talk a lot. Then uh, it was VAC PA, so uh, it was a problem for me. This phase prep course, I would say, is mind blowing. That, that helped me a lot. Because for a person like me who is good at talking but not at all good at writing, they gave me a lot of inputs which really converted my uh, call from IM on the bar. I learned the uh, importance of uh, establishing a structure while tackling any problem and also learned uh, a step by step approach while uh, preparing for and tackling uh, all the various. Uh, uh, selection procedures which includes uh, your GDs, PIs and uh, the whole host of other uh, procedures. For the past two years, uh, I think in FMS and even before that, uh, my life has been heavily influenced by whatever I learned from uh, from Edgar Sir and Rajesh Sir. Uh, especially during the time of, uh, after the card results come out and we are preparing for the GD and PI uh, processes of various colleges. There are three things that I would say which is very good at this course. One is the template approach. Point number two, when it comes to VAT and as well as to personal interview, is a structured approach. The third one is leveraging my skills. Uh, one major uh, thing that I remember uh, quite quite a lot and I also apply it, which is called uh, other person's point of view, which is something that kids have taught me. Another thing that I learned is called a cow and a flagpole approach. The biggest learning probably was uh, to use your mind by going a bit blank sometimes. So don't go with a predestined, you know, predetermined thought. Go go a bit flexible. Uh, so that in the interview or wherever, in any any position, even right now when I uh, do anything uh, in life, you, you go with an open mind so that you, you listen first and then you only then only you react to it. Rather than going, you know, pre-planning it and you know messing it up. I had an almost 100% success rate uh, as far as the GDs uh, were concerned because the uh, approach, the GD approach which I practiced while at face stayed with me. And even today uh, when I face or when I deal with multiple problems, the approach and the attitude towards solving problems which involves that of uh, structure and uh, sequencing of uh, items that still stays with me. So I would like to thank uh, Venkat and all the members of the FACE team. I think even now, even during my college, so in my college I, I work in a, I joined the placement team in the first year and then I, meet, I lead the whole efforts now. I think I meet a lot of people from the corporate and I meet a lot of CEOs uh, or even top top level management and what really helps is being naturally curious. Again, this is something which, which I saw, which I learned from them directly. Uh, Venkat sir and Rajesh sir both, they do excellent work in FACE and in Jock Street and you know, elsewhere. So, uh, process-based approach over result-based approach is something that they've again taught me, which means that you focus on doing the right things and automatically results will follow. Don't, don't focus too much on the results.